Good morning. My name is Sabrina. I am the training manager for VIA One Hope, um, and this is your new CEO training call. So today we are going to go through um, really the nitty gritty of starting your business, getting to know your back office, uh, getting yourself paid, uh, checking out the VIA University, which is chock full of tons of great tips and webinars and videos, and then also going over our Fast Start program, which is your first 60 days, and then also the Business Boost Points. Um, at VIA One Hope, we really do um, incentivize you to grow your business and earn points so that you can try new wines, bring new wines to your events, uh, purchase new uh, training materials, all that. So um, I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and we'll get started. Okay, uh, hold on one sec. Okay, let me actually share. There we go. Okay, so this is uh, viaonehope.com and how you log into your CEO back office if you haven't already done so. You just click CEO login. It, and then enter your CEO ID. Um, you can also enter your email address, but sometimes um, the system can be a little finicky. So I always like to enter my CEO ID here. and then the password you use to uh, set up your account. This is your back office and your home screen. So um, the, this is chock full of information, uh, weekly information for you. The news is on the right hand side. It's also called the Vine. This gets sent out to our CEO community every Tuesday, about midday. Um, it's chock full of information. This information right here is um, a little older. It's from last week because uh, we had the fourth on Tuesday, so we uh, did not send the Vine out this week. But um, it just includes Flash Sale, the Crush Award. We have a new speaker. Really great information. New wines are always included in this. Um, so if you don't have a chance to check out your email when it comes through, you can always check uh, your home screen. That's where the most recent, the Vine is sent, um, is included. And then on the left-hand side, you'll include your personal activity. Uh, so this is just a very basic report, goes over your personal activity. And then we have a, our reminders. Uh, one big thing to note is that our system is on central standard time. So at month end, make sure you enter all your orders on at midnight central standard time. And then um, we also have our customer service information uh, to call support, it, call this number. I would recommend adding that to your contact list on your cell phone so that it's always available to you. So that uh, if a customer calls you, like in, in an emergency situation, you can call support right away. Um, also, we have our email address uh, available here, and then our customer support hours are listed below. That's our most updated information. Um, we also have a feedback email, uh, which is a great um, option, and um, it is a no reply email. It's just where you send your ideas, um, th ways that we can improve our business, ways that we can improve our website. Uh, we would love to hear it, and most of the time we do implement um, feedback that we receive. Sometimes it does take time for us to implement them, um, but this is the best way for our whole feedback team to review the information. Um, and just so you know, uh, any questions that are sent here, unfortunately, um, will not be replied to as it is a no reply email. So make sure you send any questions that you have um, that you'd like a reply to, to support, and we'll definitely take care of that for you. Um, the next thing that I'm gonna go over uh, with you is um, personalizing your website. So um, from the home menu, you just click my profile. And then you can, you have the option to include a picture of yourself. Um, this picture is me and my husband. And um, you just click here, choose, pro, choose file, at, upload the file. If you run into any size issues, go ahead and send that picture to support. They'll size it for you and send it back. That's the best way to do that. 
Um, and then it has all your information, your CEO ID, if you ever need that, first and last name, all that. Um, it is very good, like the best idea is to keep this all updated. Um, your billing and your shipping address, make sure that is up to date because that is how um, support gets or how our home office team gets a hold of you or sends you um, any, uh, if you write into support, we pull the information here. Your contact, your cell phone number, um, make sure you have your phone number updated and your email address as that's how home office reaches out to you as well. Um, your personal website, you can see here, I just have my first and last name, uh, but you can make it anything you'd like. Um, so definitely, if you update it though, um, then you, and someone grabs the, the old name that you had, unfortunately, um, it will go to the person that you know recently had it. Um, okay, and then the next thing is we're going to uh, get you paid. So we're going to link your HyperWallet account. Um, we're gonna show you how to do that in here. Pay portal. So you click pay portal, hyper wallet profile setup. And you can see here I've created a couple. Um, so you just create a profile name, it can be anything. Uh, click pre create profile. And then you click edit profile. And you enter your CEO ID here. Save changes. And then after you've done that, you click activate profile. So what this does is it links your account to our new system. It's called Paylutions. And um, when, once you've earned your first commission payment, our commissions team will then automatically be able to pay you. Um, if this step is not completed, unfortunately, we're not able to pay you. Uh, so you would have to write into support and have it linked, and then our commissions team would then pay your account. So it really is best to make sure that you set up this before the first time you earn commissions. So if you earn commissions, say, from the 1st through the 14th or 15th this month, you would want to go in, set up your HyperWallet account so that on the 16th when we pay your commissions, the accounts will automatically link and you can um, then once our commissions team adds your account to Paylutions, you'll receive that email on the 16th to set up your Paylutions account. It's very seamless. They send you instructions um, to the email address you have set up in your back office. That's why it's very important to keep that up to date. And um, then you will be able to retrieve your commissions um, at that time. So it's very important to do that. And then also uh, the next step is to submit your W-9, which you can do, th do so through, um, you can find your W-9 through your uh, BA University. So let's see here. So it would be under resources and legal and FAQ. And you see your W-9 form here. So what you'll do is you'll print You'll download this, print it, uh, fill it out with your information, and then scan it or take a picture of it and email it to accounting at onehopewine.com. Um, and they'll have that on file for the next tax season. Uh, very easy. Okay, so the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna check out the VA University. So um, to launch your business strong, we have a great little section called, um, Let's see here. Uh, launching your business. <laughs> so we just went through the let's get started guide. Um, and then now the next step is let's get rewarded. This is where things get really fun. So um, let me move all this. Okay. So the next the biggest thing is for your first 60 days, it's called our fast start timeline. So within your first 60 days, uh, we want you to fast 
to, to jumpstart your business strong. So um, the best thing to do is to write down your first 30 days, and then we want you to write your first 60 days. So if you were to sign up today, your 30 day mark would, have, would be August 4th, and your 60 day mark would be uh, September 3rd. Okay, and so write th those dates on your calendar so that you um, know when your first 30 days is and your first 60 days. We say your first 30 days so that you can get a, a checkpoint on how you're doing in your fast start timeline. Um, that way you have 30 days to either kick it into high gear or just keep doing what you're doing. So um, just get a gauge of how you're doing in your fast start timeline. So to really maximize uh, your fast start time frame, uh, you, we encourage uh, you to book wine tastings. Um, for every two qualified events, you earn $100 in fast start rewards. So um, a qualified event is a, an event that uh, sells a minimum of $300 in sales and is closed within your party portal by the close date um, or your fast start timeline. So um, definitely book as many wine tastings as you can. We encourage new CEOs to have two to three launch events um, within their first 30 days, typically within the same weekend, so that you can really um, capitalize and learn from those events. I feel like if you do one event every like three to four weeks, you almost forget um, what you learned in that first event. Uh, so it's definitely important to, um, to jumpstart your business, to try to hold as many events as you can within those first 30 days, and then um, additional, the additional 30 days through your first 60 days. Um, so that is very important. And then recruiting is another way that we, um, you can earn points uh, in, your fast, in your fast start time frame. And that is uh, for every eligible recruit that you bring on within your first 60 days, and they uh, hold two parties of their two eligible parties of their own. You would earn one hundred dollars in fast start rewards. Um, so that's really great. So um, within your first sixty days, you have the opportunity to earn a crush award, which is this right here. So to earn your crush award, you would hold and close six qualified events within your first sixty days and recruit one eligible recruit within your first 60 days. So, um, and, you know, as I said before, an eligible recruit is someone who holds two qualified parties within their first 60 days. So, um, as it would be great to bring someone on ASAP and have them close their parties out by your first 60 days, that's not um, needed. It just needs to be, their parties need to be closed out within their first 60 days. I hope that makes sense. Um, so let's do the math here. So if you hold six qualified events, that's $300 in rewards. And then if your eligible recruit holds two qualified events in their first 60 days, there's your $100. So you would earn $400 in fast start rewards. Um, and one thing I like to note here is that there's no cap. You, if you hold 10 qualified events in your, it, in your first 60 days, uh, you can earn, um, I think it's, that would be $500 in rewards points. So there's no cap here. Um, and so that's definitely worth noting. Um, I mentioned before to make sure you close out the party correctly. Um, definitely, uh, this is very important right here. Um, so to redeem your host rewards within how to cr cl uh, correctly close out an event is to redeem your host rewards within your first within three weeks of the actual event date and press close party. That is very important. Step six is very important at all times. Um, so make sure you close your party. Um, even if, so one thing to note here also is uh, it has to be, for it to qualify for your fast start, make sure that it's closed out by the end date of your fast start. So I know we list three weeks here, um, but for our system to count it towards your fast start, it has to close towards your crush award and fast start timeline. It has to close within your fast start timeline. Uh, so that's very important. 
And then the next thing that is really cool, so within your first 60 days, you can double dip your points. You can earn fast start points and then also business booster points. So it's really great to really capitalize on your first 60 days. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull that up really quick. So business booster points is really great. This is ongoing, there is no time frame. There's no time cap, I should say. Um, this is just within each month. So between the first and the last day of the month, you have an opportunity to earn fast start or to earn business boost points. So if you sell $250 in a month in retail sales, you earn $25 in business boost points. And if you sell 750 in retail sales within a month, you earn $50 in business boost points. And if you sell $1,500 in retail sales within a month, you earn $100 in business boost points. So you can see here that selling is a big, you know, it's booking, recruiting, and selling. Those are the three big milestones, and that's what we're, um, we're incentivizing you uh, to build that from your from the start of your business. Um, so here's just a quick breakdown of how you can double dip. So say month one, your first 30 days, you sell 1,500 in retail sales. That's $100 in business boost points. You hold three event tasting events that are qualified, and you earn $100 in fast start points. So that first month, you earn $200 in fast start in uh, in business points. And then in month two, you sell 1,500 in sales, that's $100 in business boost points. Hold three tasting events, that's $200 in fast start points. And then you sign up one new recruit that uh, goes on to uh, hold two of their own events, and they, you, that, so you earn an additional $100 in fast start points. So that's $600 in rewards points just in the beginning. And then not to mention, if you, if you sell 1,500 in sales for these two months, you also get that 5% bonus. Um, so you, you earn, instead of earning 20% commission on your sales, you earn 25% commission on your sales. So it is really um, imperative to build your business from the beginning. Because uh, you, can, you can use these $600 in rewards points for merch, for business items, for wine, for gifts. Uh, for your table at events. So um, it's really, really a great incentive. And let's see here. So the next thing is um, I wanted to mention is uh, it's not too late as a new CEO to sign up for Crush uh, 2017. It is, um, let's see here. Yeah, so Crush 17 is our big conference. Um, we do one conference a year, uh, something like this. And um, this year it's July 21st through the 23rd in Irvine, California. So if you're local, definitely get your tickets. If you're not local, uh, definitely get your tickets too. But um, so we have 16 days, no, that can't be right. Is that right? 16 days until Crush, that's uh, really close. <laughs> And um, so we have some great speakers scheduled. Uh, John Elway is due to speak. That's crazy. Uh, Jake Cloberdance, our CEO. Katie, um, our vice president. Aaron Marklin. Um, and also I'm going to be speaking. Kathy's going to be speaking. Um, so it's really uh, it, great. Your business will explode if you when you attend. Um, there's a lot of great launches happening at Crush. Um, you get to bond with other CEOs, feed off of their inspiration, hear great, we're going to uh, do it, hear great stories from CEOs. Um, so it really is, it, like, if you really want to jumpstart your business, get your butt to crush. I cannot say that enough. Um, so that's my little spiel on crush and jumpstarting your business. Uh, do you, I'm going to go ahead and mute for a second. Do you have any questions? Um, I think mainly just with the W-9 form. Yeah. Um, do I need a list, like the business part of it? I've actually never filled out a W-9 form. So, so. You, you would be a, um, typically our CEOs are sole proprietors. So um, okay. they, I didn't know if I had to put one hope on there or. Um, you know, actually it would be best to email support 
uh, okay. questions on that. Um, I okay. Can't okay. The best way to handle that, um, but they can definitely answer your questions. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. All right. No problem. That was it. Yeah. Awesome. Well, uh, thank you so much for joining, and I hope you have a great week. And don't forget to jump on our. We have a training call tomorrow for the community, uh, ten thirty, same same uh, Zoom link. So um, and cool. it'll be recorded just like this one. Uh, so. Definitely okay, jump perfect. on. Yeah, yeah. Well, have a good week. All right. Thanks. You too. Bye. Bye.